Don't be touching my baby girl without permission now, soldier man. You just stick to them guns and the Nazi killer. What about you? Why don't you step up and join the fight? What fight? Your fight? You took your orders from the man. The U.S. motherfucking government, man. What a trip. The war came and the man came calling. He sent my daddy to war and he did not return him. The bombs fell on our great cities and the man ran scared. Motherfucking gave up, you know? <laughs> Nazis asked him to get down on his knees and the man was all too happy just to pucker up and start kissing Nazi ass like it was the most natural thing in the world, you know? I had to cross an ocean to get away from that place. They would have thrown me in the gas chamber just like they did all the others. None of that has anything to do with me. That's not the America I fought for. Really? I was little. My mother wanted to take me to the picture show, but we had to go in through the fucking colored entrance. I wanted a hot dog and a lemonade, but the sign says we don't serve Negroes in this establishment. You're a patriot. Blue-eyed, jawhead, motherfucking Nazi-killing patriot that you are. You're still a fucking puppet to the man. You're exactly the kind of guy they ordered in come lynching time. <laughs> you don't get it, do you? Before all this, before the Germans, before the war, back home, man, you were the Nazis. Be careful what you call me. Violence. Language of the man. Can't you see? We're all just brothers and sisters now, aren't we? Hey, soldier man. You play? <laughs> 